And we'll see how we do with Iran. Probably we won't do very well with them, but that's okay, too. Uh, they've got to understand life, because I don't think they do understand life. If you look at what's happening in the Middle East with Syria, with Yemen, with all of the places they're involved, it's bedlam and death. And we can't allow that to happen. Oh, we have terminated a terrible, terrible deal that should have never, ever been made. And we will be putting on among the strongest sanctions that we've ever put on a country. And they're going into effect very shortly. They're mostly constituted and drawn already. And we'll just have to see what happens. But we can't allow a deal to hurt the world. That's a deal to hurt the world. That's not a deal for the United States. That's a deal to hurt the world. So we're going to make either a, a really good deal for the world, or we're not going to make a deal at all. And Iran will come back and say, we don't want to negotiate. And of course, they're going to say that. And if I were their position, I'd say that, too, for the first couple of months. We're not going to negotiate, but they'll negotiate. Or something will happen. Uh, and hopefully, that won't be the case. Yes. Iran will find out. They're going to find out. I don't think they should do that. I would advise Iran not to start their nuclear program. I would advise them very strongly. If they do, there will be very severe consequences.